Greetings Fountain Hills and welcome to the very first episode of Uniquely Fountain Hills, a monthly video series designed to spotlight the diversity of business here in town and encourage residents to shop local. I'm your host Paige Martin and I'm the events and marketing manager at the Fountain Hills Chamber of Commerce and I'm thrilled to be here on Uniquely Fountain Hills. We all know that Fountain Hills is home to car enthusiasts, neighborhoods filled with beautiful homes and even gardens that resemble the beautiful Sonoran Desert. So tonight we're spotlighting three different businesses in home, garden and you guessed it, the automotive industry. Whether you are looking to purchase or restore, even repair and insure an automobile, chances are that you can do it right here in Fountain Hills. Our first featured business is the perfect example. Let's motor on over to Impact Collision to learn more about what they have going under the hood. If you own a car, new or old, we're here to do your car repair. If it's, if it's a cosmetic repair, we can do that. If it's painting it, or maybe that favorite car you had in high school that you want brought back to life, we can do that. Our three main services, well, we do express services. So let's say you're pulling out of the garage, you scratch your car. Uh, most of those turn around are 24 hours to 48 hours, sometimes same day. Um, so we do express services. We do collision repair on all makes and models. Um, whatever insurance company you have, we work with those insurance companies, along with classic car insurance. So there's a lot of classic cars in Fountain Hills. So, you know, they need a place to go to. Well, we do classic car uh, insurance repair and also uh, paint and body and restoration of classic cars. My most favorite thing is to see the process in a state like this, and then after it's done, see it in a state like this. And that's with the customers, and that is with everything that we do here. It's just exciting to see the process that it goes through, and the staff that we have on hand that really care about the work that they do. We, you know, strive for customer satisfaction. We believe in transparency. Um, you know, we have customers come in for many, many different things. It could be putting on a molding, uh, to putting on a bumper, or to fix a scratch, or a collision, or they backed up and, and they wrecked their car. We don't say no. And if you look at the comments that people have left us on Google, you know, it speaks for, them, it speaks for itself. Bill and his partner, Laura Norton, are planning to build and expand their facility just across the street in the near future, and it's going to be so exciting to watch that business grow. And speaking of growing, classic automobiles like these being displayed tonight at Phil's Filling Station as part of the Fountain Hills Summer Nights Car Show make great decorations for our garages. But what about our lawns and gardens? Fountain Hills has that too. Verde Valley Nursery has been a Fountain Hills fixture since 1984, and while the business has changed hands several times, well, let's just say their commitment to customer service is perennial. Well, we are the only nursery in town, so, um, and because it's such a small town, I'm always looking uh, for to work with different vendors because I want to bring a big variety of either plants, um, pottery. If you notice, even though we are a small retail nursery, I have a lot of variety of metal, pottery, plants, 15-gallon shrubs, trees, cactus. I mean, yes, it's small, but I like to keep a little bit of variety. That way my customers can come and say, oh, no, that nursery doesn't have this, the nursery doesn't, no, we have, we have it all. And another thing that makes it a little bit more better as, you know, in regards to our landscaping company is that because we have the nursery business, we know how to maintain the plants, we know how to take care of the flowers, we know how to, what sun exposure, what uh, shade exposure it needs, how much water it takes, where to plant it. So that makes it a little bit more unique. So when people are coming in and taking, you know, and um, buying plants, we actually can give them good advice as far as your landscaping as well and how to take care of them. It's not just going to Home Depot and then you're just picking beautiful plants and then taking them home. Here you actually get the 411 of all plants just because we want you to be successful because that's what makes our business successful at the end. 
I, we take a lot of pride in our nursery. Um, so we always want to make sure that we get everybody's feedback, whether it's positive or negative. We want to make sure that we know about it because um, Sa both Sam and I, um, this is our bread and butter, the, the nursery, even though we have the landscaping companies. Well, to me in, in particular, this is my, I call it my personal baby because, you know, I've watched it grow. We've changed it a lot and um, always for the better, I, I hope, and I hope that the customers see that as well. Can you believe that Sandra has been in the nursery and landscaping business for nearly half her life? She told us that she fell in love with Verde Valley Nursery when she began working for them, and we know that you will too. And now that we've introduced you to businesses that can beautify your vehicles and home gardens, let's meet Karen Otis of Otis Architecture. She is someone that can beautify your home or office space inside and out. Otis Architecture and Interiors is a full service design home. Basically we start from concept all the way to completion. We work on brand new builds from the ground up to big remodels to smaller remodels to kitchen remodels to full tenant improvement spaces such as we've been doing with all the rest of Park Place. We've been doing all the storefronts and uh, creating those spaces. It's a combination of exterior architecture and interior design as well. My involvement here, so we moved here about two and a half years ago and fell in love with it. I wish I would have been here the last 20. Um, and then got involved with the Chamber of Commerce, which was a fantastic thing to do because it helped me kind of meet a lot of people. I became an ambassador for them and then have met people and worked on projects with them as well as the Chamber of Commerce building, uh, which is newly, uh, has been newly designed. And in doing that, I've been able to really see how strong the trend is for business here. Um, the Chamber definitely puts a lot of emphasis on that. And I've been able to really impact or have an impact by creating the storefronts here on the avenues, really bringing some vitality to Park Place and the Avenue of the Fountains. It's a beautiful town, but of course, it, it like everything else, it needs upkeep, it needs some, you know, periodic flair to it and that's what we really have been able to do. So creating that kind of strolling environment along the avenues has been a, a strong priority of mine. And we've been busily doing all the projects that um, line the street. And I think in the long run for the town, it's gonna be fantastic not only for the residents, but visitors too. Karen was responsible for the design of the Fountain Hills Chamber of Commerce building and we just love our new space. Can you believe that she wanted to be a lawyer or psychiatrist when she was younger? Fortunately, a women in architecture field trip changed everything for her when she was only 16 years old. And that's all I have for the very first episode of Uniquely Fountain Hills. If you are in the market for any of the amenities featured in today's video, please visit them or you can always call the Chamber of Commerce here in Fountain Hills for a full list of other businesses that provide similar services. From Phil's Filling Station, here tonight at the Fountain Hills Summer Nights Car Show, thank you so much for watching. I'm Paige Martin, and I hope to see you next month for the next episode of Uniquely Fountain Hills. Until then, remember to shop local and shop Fountain Hills.